It is time now for this day in Mets history. Going to take a look back two years ago today. The Major League debut of Steven Matz. A big day in Mets land, the Matz debut. Steven Matz takes the mound for the first time at City Field. One, two coming. And Bird goes around strength three. Two, two to Smith. And the curveball got him lucky. Three, two to Votto. Strike three call. Great, great start for him. He's as advertised. Pretty impressive. One, six, three, double play. Steven Matz with a double drives home a pair. DeGrom said it good. He said, now you're a big leader. Give a couple home runs, got a couple strikeouts, got a couple hits, so did it all today. Steven Matz, three for three. Matz has driven in four of the Mets' five runs. He struck him out. Steven Matz finishes his debut with a flourish. Time now for Nelson's Mound visit. So when it comes to Noah, and we talk about mechanics so much, and he's been in the big leagues for just about a couple of years now. As you look at him, how has he evolved? Looking at them, seen the that symbols, stuff. and now they, they look. Talk about what you're looking for. The hitter picks it up, so that's where a spot shadow would be, because you know what we can do a, a nice paint one to do is we'll put the circle where his hands are, and I guarantee you when he goes to throw the ball, it's very close to where his hands were before. One thing he always talks about with mechanics is about repeating his delivery, trying to simplify things and trying to make it as easy and as efficient as possible to do it over and over and over again. He's really good at doing this. And when he first started, there was a lot of moving parts. You see how high up the hands were right there in 2015. The hands were at the waist last year. You see his feet facing forward towards the catcher, more like the stretch, that little stutter step right there. But the hands were staying up high in 2015. That lets the hitter see the ball very well, see the angle with how high his leg kick was in 2015 2016 more 90 degrees there's what I'm talking about it's very close to his head where the ball's being released the hitter doesn't have to look very far to try and recognize pitch or see if he's tipping to me he was tipping pitches especially when he threw his changeup in 2015 we haven't seen the same kind of results versus changeup ever since he moved it down to his waist Maybe one of the most underrated relievers in the game. Castillo hits one deep to right field. Turning and looking is Judge. See ya. That one's drilled deep to left. There it goes. See ya. Grand slam. That's into the bleachers in left field. And it is 9-1-0s. Three, two. Drill deep to center field. That ball is into Monument Park. That one is drilled deep to right field. There it goes. See ya. A grand slam for Ellsbury. And the Yankees are back in it. That one is drilled deep to left field. There it goes. See ya. A tie game. The Yankees have come. Pitch is swung on and drilled to deep center. It is gone. A game-winning walk-off three-run home run for Matt Holliday. And baby, that's about as good a game as you'll ever see.